Hi everyone, my name is Jake, and I want to share a quick fix for an issue I was having with my Universal Audio Apollo Twin Thunderbolt 2 audio interface using Discord voice chat on macOS. When using my Apollo as the audio input for Discord, I would sometimes be audible to the rest of my chat participants, but there would be constant signal dropouts and other issues with my voice input. The simplest solution I found is unfortunately not free, but there are probably free alternatives out there. If you're aware of any or have an alternative fix for the issue, please let us know your solution in the comments. The software that has made my Apollo interface work seamlessly with Discord is called Loopback by Rogue Amoeba, and you'll quickly see why I went with their product for my solution. There's a trial version available with limited usability, but it's a good way to test whether or not the solution will work for you. It's $99, which is obviously a lot of money to resolve such a small issue, but it's a powerful and helpful audio tool for Mac users that can accomplish a lot more than this simple task. I'm not affiliated with Rogue Amoeba in any way, they just have a great arsenal of audio-centric software. Once you have Loopback installed and running, the rest is simple. On the left, your new Loopback audio device can be switched on and off and has its own volume control. This audio device will be your new Discord input. To set it up, we'll add Universal Audio Thunderbolt as our one and only source device, and then we'll keep the stereo output channel. There's no need to change or select anything for your monitor section since we'll be keeping our Discord output the same. The last step is to drag a new connection from whichever input you're using for your microphone to both channels of the output. My microphone is always on input 1, so I'm dragging a wire from there to channel 1 and 2 in the output section. If your mic is set up in console, you can test it and see your signal metering on all of those channels. You can even add other audio devices and use virtual channels in your universal audio software to send audio from anywhere on your Mac or other devices to your Discord audio. The last step is to open Discord and go to your settings window, then select voice and video. We can now see our loopback audio device under input and we'll select that. If you aren't seeing it in that list, make sure the device is switched on and loop back. And additionally, you may need to restart your Mac if you still don't see it. You don't need to make any changes to your output device in Discord, so you should be all set. There's a lot more we could explore with sending audio from different devices to any application using loopback, but simply using the loopback audio input and routing our microphone to it has not given me any issues. My name is Jake with JP Audio. Please like and subscribe to see many more audio tips, tutorials, and demos. Please feel free to leave comments and questions. I'm happy to help. Thanks for watching.